what is most normally thought of as a all white art form for an all white audience has been turned completely upside down by the work that John has done. One of his big passions is, is uh, the lack of arts education in schools. When he came to Cal Shakes, one of the first things he did was establish a whole new arts artistic learning program. We take world-class teaching artists into classrooms, predominantly in underserved communities. We're bringing Shakespeare to kids. And in reimagining the classics, that's what we strive to do. It broadens the theater as a participant in the community. He has literally changed the face of not just California Shakespeare theater, but by extension, theater arts in the state of California. It was an illuminating experience, and John Moscone changed Cal Shakes. His creativity is extraordinary. He's sort of filthy with integrity. He has a creative genius that is just unmatched. He's just an irresistible force of nature. Jonathan is uh, wired on both sides of his brain. Over the years, he's mellowed a little bit. <laughs> But not much. Often flying in the face of convention. He's crazy. Or artistic Tourette's or something. He, he just can't help but tell the truth. <laughs> he's just emotional, he's loud. He reminded us of, of Tigger because he was always bouncing around. He has more ideas fly through his head in a split second than I think most people do in an hour or a day or a week. Uh, he's just taken it to a whole different level. You know, for somebody as uh, egotistical as John, he's He's also humble, and he's humble before the work, and he's humble before the audience. Jonathan is gutsy. He's a brave man. We are incredibly lucky to have him in the Bay Area. So to Jonathan, I say thank you. Jonathan, you make a difference. Congratulations, Jonathan. I have nothing but great expectations for the future of Cal Shakes and for John Moscone. The work of John Moscone will leave its mark on the San Francisco Bay Area for decades to come.